for the mini series on what after 12th or what after second pc i am your kartik ate and i have my junior come friend saklesh with me welcome saklesh thank you so much uh, saklesh is of 22 years old and he has completed his bsc in chronology and forensic science from karnataka science college and now he is pursuing his msc in forensic science uh, at uh, rashtriya raksha university gujarat right so today in this session we are going to discuss what is this bsc uh, basic science and what are the courses we get and about forensic science and about these universities which offer this ss and what all the opportunities we have based on this forensic science right so let's get started so i request saklesh to tell us about this basic science okay. and its courses first, yeah yes first of all thank you and uh, congratulations for uh, getting the gold medal in msc chemistry <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and clearing the set exam and becoming the assistant professor all the best yeah, thanks man <laughs> so let me start how i started after 12th so i was into the bachelors in into the forensics a criminology and forensic science so with along with the anthropology and zoology as my subjects in karnataka science college so uh, initially i have no idea Uh, had no idea about how to uh, how about the forensic science and all. Later, I got to know, so I got interested and uh, I wanted to pursue this as my uh, in my masters. So basically, I chose the best best universities uh, accordingly, and uh, I found uh, I given entrances exams for other universities as well. and uh, finally i chose to be in the rashtriya raksha university formerly known as raksha shakti university it was under the state government of uh, uh, gujarat for the plus 2 students uh, many of you might not be knowing about the forensic science at all so this will be an introductory just i am not using any technical terms or great great terminologies so basic concepts so <laughs> so uh, i am going to tell you that just go with the basic science so forensic science is an applied science so we have we forensic is just a uh, term itself says that uh, belonging to the code of justice means uh, to the law we are applying the scientific principles and the techniques to the law go forward you have to be a uh, good at these scientific principles techniques and uh, many other skills so we go with the basic sciences like physics chemistry chemistry and uh, mathematics all such subjects yes yes that would be but uh so like so this see here basic science means what we have learned till 12th uh, that science only we continue uh, it is for we were and uh, what we do uh, like uh, continue the bsc means bachelor's in science later on we move for this msc masters in science right so the, what we have studied till now that same thing will continue and uh, there will be courses like physics chemistry math forensic science right and yes. this biology yes. which, uh, biology which we learn uh, as in 12th one subject that will be broken down into many here like botany zoology genetics yes. biotechnology microbiology there are so many right right and saklesh we yes. had around 26 combinations right in kcd yes yes yes, yes. there are many combinations man <laughs> so so if i want to speak about the kcd it's huge it's, <laughs> uh, when, <laughs> when it comes to forensic science uh, that's what i'm telling uh, in degrees it's totally different uh if you want to go with the forensic science in the kcd so you have to choose uh, the best combinations with chemistry zoology would be a better combination for forensic science otherwise if you are interested in the physics it would be of uh, physics mathematics and forensic science would be a better option and these like combinations and permutations are available only in the our karnataka science college uh in the karnataka apart from this uh, there are private universities in karnataka and outside karnataka and if you are going for abroad also but uh, and there are uh, courses like bsc honors in forensic science 
so uh, choose uh, choose wisely choose the best and move on i uh, i prefer going with the basic sciences later on you can go for the masters as well and we'll discuss that in the next question sir yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, why why it is so cyclic? Why it's uh, better for this basic science? Why, and then how to continue for this master? How it is better? Yeah, yes, yes. That's what I want to speak. See, when uh, when it comes to the uh, career point of view later on, uh, uh, just go and read the what are the guidelines means so the people they are preferring in the forensic science laboratories. So the preferable the preferables are MSc in basic sciences only, but they are, now they are added like forensic science as well. But your bachelor should be in the relevant field of uh, pure science, basic sure. science. Um, For example, uh, if you want to join as a forensic biology or DNA division as a junior scientific officer, so your master should be in forensic science. Or biotechnology, or microbiology, or molecular biology, biochemistry, etc. And your basics means your bachelor's must be must consist of a zoology, botany, such basic subjects. So here all the people means screened out. That's what. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you are interested, go with the uh, forensic science as uh, one of the subject you can learn. As the best combinations in the KCD. Apart from that, you can go for online courses and get to know about that. Yeah. So, uh, the masters. Yeah, yeah. How were you preparing during this uh, degree in this BSc? How were you preparing for this FS? Yeah, <laughs> it was fun, man. Uh, I enjoyed learning. Uh, means uh, not not much much reading about. And all, I, I used to enjoy an academy as well because uh, when you <laughs> when you see my mark sheets, it's not all about the numbers that matter at the end. But uh, yeah, you have to be uh, the best. And then only you can be a more can go move forward in with a lot of confidence. Yeah. So do well in academics as well as an, an academic as. Well. Yeah, yeah, that is true. Because experience counts. Uh, this uh, <laughs> these masters yeah. are only once we get it. Uh, otherwise, do no use of those uh, experience a lot. <laughs> it counts a lot. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, yes. Like, how did you came, come to know about this Raksha University, Rashtriya Raksha University? Yes. Uh, from the beginning of my bachelor's uh, at KCD, uh, our seniors used to tell. That if you are looking for the masters, even our professors, so uh, just go out, out of the state, so you'll get a better opportunities. And yes, and that was true because my seniors were uh, successful, and not only successful, but they are in uh, were at careers they have pursued really well, and they have set a standards. So that's why. I was always looking to go outside, and being in the Karnataka was uh, my last option. And yeah, <laughs> because only in the field of the forensic science it is like that. Apart from that, uh, Karnataka tops man in educational sector. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what about the admission procedure there? How should a degree student should come to know about that? Yes. Uh, in the final year, you have to make a preparations for that. Means in a bachelor's, uh, like uh, the universities which are providing the forensic science masters in forensic science, make a list of it and just bookmark the uh, URLs of the such universities, and it will be called in uh, April and May. Now it's our university just called for the fresh batch for 21, 22. So. Uh, just keep a tab on your laptops or mobiles, phones, so get the notification. And there will be for for the some universities there will be an entrance exam. Most of the universities and based on your merit as well. So prepare well in your bachelor's and uh, get a good marks in the bachelor's. Yeah, 
this entrance exam consists of only forensic science or uh, questions will be out of that also no 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 it's it's all, all over the basic sciences plus to 11 uh -huh. as well as forensic sciences forensic science basic basics, basics yes and yes. also they will consider their uh, degree marks i guess yes uh, it was uh, mine was based on uh, the degree marks degree so, marks yeah, yeah. Uh, both are yes, equally yes. important both are both are equally important because so many students what did they do i will crack that uh, let's uh, enjoy here without getting personally that thing also uh, he is the trend yes, yes. so that should now, not be. now it's yes now it's very difficult now it's very difficult because the university they have means upgraded to the uh, central have taken and they are right now in the ministry of home affairs government oh. of india so uh, it's a uh, yeah, institute of national importance Okay. Yes, uh -huh. they have significantly reduced the number of seats. Yeah, yeah. So it's very difficult to compete and get there. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you have really you have to be a beast. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, there are uh, yes, there are uh, many uh, like not only a forensic science. Say there are a variety of the courses in, with the forensics. So we'll talk about shall I go ahead? Or? Yeah, you, you continue, you continue supply. Yeah. Yes. See, there are courses in the forensics like uh, forensic psychology and digital forensics. Okay. Uh, so many courses are there. Like uh, universities, like the National Forensic Sciences Universities, it has a uh, Gandhinagar campus as well as Delhi campus. So you apply there also. So it uh, it will be a better. And uh, especially talking about my university, it's a pioneering police university. So we have got all the police courses, like uh, police administration, criminology, and law, and like cyber, cyber forensics, digital forensics, forensic science. So it supports the police system, which trains the police officials or. Uh, Which makes a uh, research and developments in the police. So this yeah. is all about my yeah. university. Taklish, what are the opportunities? Whether we can go for like uh, most will be like a uh, CID. <laughs> Such things will come into yeah. mind once we hear this forensic science. Uh, so what are exactly. all the opportunities are there with this? Effect? Exactly, uh, exactly. Many students uh, want to pursue forensic science. masters or bachelors are fascinated by the shows like uh, as you said like fbi and cid cbi so many things it's great that you will be enthusiastic to pursue the in this uh, career path so but in reality it's different different we have to work together and uh, there are lots of specializations See, if you take in the forensic science, how the laboratory works uh, in all across India, it's under the directorate of forensic sciences. So there are so uh, six plus one seven uh, central forensic science laboratories, and every state has its own forensic science state forensics laboratories and uh, regional laboratories as well. They are working together, and uh, there comes a hierarchy. Uh, sorry. Uh, hierarchy in the positions, but there are different uh, different uh, departments working to solve the crimes. Like uh, departments like ballistics, physics. So they involve the firearm cases, explosion cases, and there comes the your chemistry and toxicology, and there come uh, and uh, biology division, serology division, and DNA division. So so many so many departments psychology. Many many divisions man, to tackle the crime and to provide the justice. And yes, it's yeah. a chain. It's a chain. We call from the crime scene to the court. From the crime scene to the court. How we go? How we visit the crime scene? So how we collect uh, the evidences and how how we proceed means how we transport, how we package and how how to send it to the laboratories and we work on that and. Last again, and again, at the end, you have to be in the court. So, hmm. the guilt or the innocence of the offender will be 
question there. Uh-huh. Judge, judge. Uh, judge. Yes. Uh, Sakhlesh, uh, whether uh, there are a lot of opportunities on FS in India or like uh, we should go for abroad like that? Uh, it's it's a really difficult question. <laughs> Means uh, uh, what I can say now it's really uh, forensic is taking its higher steps. Means it's growing in India. India. So better you pursue yes, better pursue with your basic sciences subjects in in a bachelor's and uh, try some of the universities. The best universities I have mentioned and there are many other universities that I would not picked up. So obviously, just explore in India and get there. If not, if you have a good amount of money, so you can go for abroad as well. Yeah, uh, those links will be given by Sakhlesh in my description box, right? Sakhlesh, that we can done. Yeah, sure. Uh, sure. Uh, uh, Sakhlesh, if you want to give some advices for these the few students, what it will be? Yeah. So. You are in the PUC, so many many society and parental pressure will be there. So don't take such pressures. You know your capabilities. You know your abilities. What you can do. So prepare well. Prepare well. So just be cool and you know you have, it's a stage where you can build yourself a confidence, get clarity about all the subjects, concepts, and how you can go further and. It will count, man. Whether you go for the masters or PhD or so many, many more. But what's the basic is plus two. So it's very important stage. So yeah, yeah. Be confident. Crack all the exams. And uh, if you fail, it's it's okay. There are many different fields, and you can excel. Yeah, yeah, that is true. That's a clash. Thank you for your uh, for sparing your time. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for providing uh, yeah, this platform. Ah, uh, we got so many things to learn about forensic science. Yeah, sure. We'll collaborate with you in the future so that I can explain more better. Uh, and yeah, yeah, more it. better. Ah, uh, that can be done here. Yeah. So this is a very good platform to reach it in India. If in case of say in abroad also. <laughs> Yes. Uh, yeah, yes. Sir, huh? uh, I catch you soon, Sakhle. Thank you. Thank you yeah, so thank, much. Thank you. Thank you, Sakhle. So this was the story with Sakhle. I hope you have enjoyed about this forensic science. If so, give me a like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.